So let's say I wanted to find the intersection between this line and this plane. Okay? So, essentially what we need to understand is that the R here, remember, R is equal to X, Y, Z. So in order for this line to intersect this plane, I'm going to need a set of coordinates, x, y, z, uh, that fits the equation of the line and the equation of the plane. So this x, this y, and this z must be the same as that x, that y, and that z. But each of these can be written as the top, middle, and bottom row of the line. So x is equal to 2 plus 5 lambda, y is equal to 1 take away 1 lambda, and minus 3, so z is equal to minus 3 take away 2 lambda. So this is your x, y, and z, which we can now substitute into the equation of the plane. So 3 lots of 2 plus 5 lambda plus 8 lots of 1 take away lambda take away 2 lots of minus 3, take away 2 lambda, plus 4 is equal to 0. OK, so if I expand this out, solve for lambda, then I can substitute the lambda back in here to work out the x, y, and z that works. So 6 plus 15 lambda, plus 8, take away 8 lambda, uh, plus 6, plus 4 lambda, plus 4, equals 0. So, uh, what have we got? 15, take away 8, plus 4, so 11 lambda. And we've got 6, plus 8, plus 6, plus 4. So, plus 24, equals 0. So, lambda's going to be equal to minus 24 over 11. So that's the value of lambda. So I just need to now substitute it in here to work out the point of intersection. So point of intersection, intersection is, so we'll have two plus five lots of minus 24 elevenths, one take away minus 24 elevenths, minus three, take away two lots of minus 24 elevenths. So two plus five lots of minus 24 elevenths is minus 98 elevenths. Then one plus 24 elevenths is 35 elevenths. And then minus three, take away two lots of minus 24 elevenths is 15 elevenths. So this is the point of end section of the line and the plane.